My name is Uwe Kapper and I'm from Microcontrol. And uh, so what kind of products do you do? Uh, we are doing products around uh, typical industrial area, uh, but this is a wide area, especially if you have a look at our products, you would see they are used in avionics, in medical systems, in uh, military applications, and for us, products, uh, they need to be precise, fast, reliable, robust. These are the major keywords we um, need for our products. So it, it, it looks maybe something like this up there, um, this kind of uh, product there, is it what this is? Yes, so right. What is this for? This uh, module here is an analog output module with four channels and it's connected to the CAN bus and it runs via CAN open or any other higher layer CAN protocol. And uh, there's an ST chipset inside? Yeah, sure. It's the STM32. So, um, uh, what does it do, the chipset? What software is it running? Oh, um, it's uh, the, the code itself. It's written in, in C code and uh, we have a can open protocol stack inside that because we are using bus systems and we are putting out the, the data via the analog channels of the SDM32. And this device like this also? What yeah. does this one do? Um, this one is a customer project and uh, we did this for a customer who has uh, encoder applications and he wanted to have three additional analog input channels which are fast, sophisticated, robust in his application. And uh, so we did this customer module. And uh, so have you been working uh, as a company with ST for a long time? Yeah, now I think for more than 20 years already. So uh, wh why do you work with ST? What's special about it? I think very special for ST is they have reliable products. They are, I would say, very sophisticated, easy to understand. And for us, especially important is the long-term availability. And additionally, I can say, since we switched to STM32 family, we're quite happy with that because we have uh, pin compatibility throughout the family. And this is very, very important for us. So then you can consider updating or ch uh, upgrading to a new one or Yes, Changing right. To different I mean, parts. I mean, even even when the customer comes along and says, "Well, I've got a price-sensitive product," we can say, "Okay, we can downsize it and take a chip from the ST family, which has not such a high price." Or even if we have applications which demand higher data throughput, then we can select a chip which has these features. For example, Cortex M4 or M7. And so these are kind of like how it looks. The devices and uh, this this is an example of uh, is this an old one? This is quite an old one. I think we did that 15 years ago, and uh, this was for a, a customer project where we uh, did something concerning a, a server drive. So I guess it's uh, not used any longer uh, for new applications. However, it's still available, and that's the it's good thing. It's still working. It's still uh, yeah, sure, that's still working. And uh, there's all these uh, other kinds of devices right here. Uh, and uh, so the embedded world is important for your company. Yeah, sure. I mean, the embedded is important for us as well as the SPS IPC drives. And uh, so where are you based? We are based in Germany um, in a city called Troisdorf that's just in the middle between Cologne and Bonn. 